Hello all my little mag boys out there and welcome to another Badly Coated Impressions video. This time we're going to be checking out Night of the Dead. Now Night of the Dead is, uh, well I'll tell you what, I'll just read from the Steve description because I don't actually know what it is so let's find out together. Night of the Dead is an open world game that combines elements of exploration, tower defense, ooh, survival and crafting. Traverse a world dominated by zombies and collecting various resources and powerful equipment. Equipment? Equipment! I don't know how equipment suddenly got a T in, but you know. Uh, build a fortress and survive the hordes of zombies that swarm every night. So, uh, yeah, that sounds cool. It sounds a bit like uh, Seven Days. Except the hordes come every night, which I'm also looking forward to. Let's just jump straight into this, shall we? Whoop! And suddenly person. I'm guessing that's me. Out of cryosleep. Why is it always out of cryosleep? Everything's out of cryosleep. Fallout 4 cryosleep. It's this. I mean, it's cool. Hello? Is anybody a boot? Obviously not. I guess they all been eaten by zombies. Zombies! Just, just, you know, casually get up and whoop. Uh, she... I guess she just jumped off. It just looked a bit funny. Right, okay. Ooh. Free, free music! That's just what I want to hear when I land out of choir sleep. Is free music. Let's uh, take the free music. Yoink. Oh, it's a walkie-talkie. I never saw that bit. <laughs> now we just listen. Still, Mr. Zombie. I'm busy. So shuffle off to another stall. A person. Are you currently in the other Well, like, uh, I don't think a zombie will be able to put earplugs in. No offense, but zombies ain't big on brains. I'm Dr. What's Veronica that? Grimes. I'm researching a zombie mm. cure. Is there even power in the bunker now? I don't know, is there? Find it? a light immediately and secure the line of sight. I, I don't want to find a light immediately. I'll do it in a minute. I'm looking. I'm looking around. Move out of my way. Oh, rest in peace. Well, at least I know there's some other people out. A light. Nice, but the light doesn't actually move. That's cool. Right, L for light. Boink. There we go. Open the exit door. Don't mind if I do. I need your help with the zombie cure research. Oh, you need my help, do you? You've just emerged from the stasis capsule. No, I you haven't emerged. I woke up. Groves. Find something to wear and get dressed. No, I don't want to find anything to wear. I want to be naked forever. I was born naked and I'll die naked. Can we just skip this room? Oh, no, we can't. At least we know what we're doing. I... Right. Uh, this better be just a quick click. Yes. That's the way I like it. Old shoes. Well, I do prefer new shoes, but, you know. I Can I go now? Nice. Find the remaining mutant substance on Andorra Ooh. Island. Give me, give me, give me, give me stuff, give me stuff, give me stuff. Take all. Cure. Succeed, and I'll send a helicopter for your rescue. Make sure to record. Yeah, yeah I'm sure time. you will. I'm sure you will. What, what have you got, dead boy? Bone. Take it. I would take your bone and put it to good use. That sounds a bit wrong, but you know, whatever. Oh, another dead guy. Has he got bones? No, dead guy not got bones. Okay. Bye. Uh, control to crouch. Okay, I can do that. Look a bit silly when I crouch, but what? Oh, hello. He's not got a head, JR. Okay. Um, anything to loot?
No, is that an elevator? A beep boop beep boop? No, can't beep boop beep boop. Right. Ooh. Oh. Open the door. Hello. Oh, what's the better needs going to come alive? The zombie mutation first occurred on Andorma. People who escaped from the island to that to at that time caused the world to be engulfed in zombie mutations. I'm starting to think that the mutant substance I was researching might have triggered the zombie mutation. But would Dr. Cleon remove such No. But would Dr. Cleon make such a mistake? Uh, probably would. Wait, I'm guessing if this guy is going to come alive, now is a good time as any. Although, he's got no red either. Can we loot the cupboards? Yes, we can. Nice. I'm not sure about the control scheme. R oh, to close. How about just escape? Right. Open the yellow door. Well, what's a yellow door? I think I'll loot these all first. But what are they anyway? Painkillers. Right, we've got a shitload of painkillers so we could get high on painkiller, guys. Close the door. What were you born in a barn? Oh, that's a yellow door. Hello? Oh, main story the update. Is the research facility where the new humanity project was conducted. Check if there's still someone in the bunker who can help you find the mutant substance. Well, if there's someone left in the bunker, they've been in here a long time. But I will have a look. Is it this guy? No, he's got no red either. Right, let's check that. Energy bar. Well, the loot so far isn't very exciting. What well, we got? Energy bar, painkillers, and a bone. A bone. Talk to the survivor. Is there a survivor? I'm a survivor. I'm guessing it through this door. Oh, uh, you appear to be dead. Did you die as humans or did you die as zombies? I shall never know. Oh, hello. I take it you're the uh, survivor, are you? I'll close the door just in case. You know, if you've got anything to loot. Damn, those old style monitors. I can remember when I was mean, saying, wait a ton. Hello. Uh, you do not look injured. Why are you not attempting to get out? Why are you just sitting there looking at me? Are you really human? No, I'm a robot. Finding me in a place like this, you're lucky. Why am I? I'm why am I lucky that I found you? You're, you're lucky I found substance, you. I can help you. In exchange, you need to secure a spot for me on the escape helicopter. Do I now? Island. I don't need to do deal, anything. Right? I've stored the mutant substance at the research center on the surface. You go to the surface first through the bunker door. I'll follow once it's safe. Oh, okay. Very, um, you know, manly. Oh, I thought that once it's safe. Uh, when am I actually going to get attacked by zombies? Right, open the door and move when in the hallway. Is that this one? Yes. Right, uh, jump over obstacles. Nice. Right. Uh, that door was open just a minute ago, but whatever. Oh, hello. Are you a survivor? Recruit. Okay. Let's do this. Yeah, let's do this. Get out of my way. I want to, uh... Can you get out of my way? I want to, uh... Have a look. To get stronger, we need to upgrade our equipment. Thanks, Joanna. I, I know how these things go. I, f I thought F meant execute then. <laughs> I thought it said execute rather than exchange. So, is there anything in there? No. 
Oh. We should head to the research center that Walter mentioned. Show me your Yes, we should. It I is right in front of me, so you know. Uh, that's kind of what I'm doing. I'm looking at stuff. But, you know. Onwards and upwards, upwards and onwards. Right, let's go. Seeing this as a bunker, that was a very easy door to open. Okay, so it's intriguing so far. Well, hello. You to survive before you even think about finding the mutant substance. Understood? Yes. I've assembled the best team of experts for assistance. But well, I've got the lovely Joanne here. So Nice to meet you. My name is Sierra Wilder. Nice to meet you, Sierra, even though technically I've not met you. I'll share all the survival knowledge I know. Can I turn my light off? Yeah. Why, right, uh you were going to share your survival knowledge? Nice. How about picking up noticeable small stones in the forest? Um, because... Okay, that's kick. That's not take. Right, now I've got small stones. Now what? Small stone to make a stone knife. Wow, a stone knife! Tell me, H. Uh, stone knife. Cough. Wow. Can I equip stone knife now? Yes. Nice. I have a kniffy. Now, shall we gather some branches and leaves? Branches and leaves? Right. Are those, those branches and Check leaves? Missing any no, no, I didn't mean to do that. This could be cool with friends. Unfortunately, I have no friends. Well, as the next step, we'll be crafting other tools necessary for survival. Will we? Nice. Like what? <laughs> Woodcutter's axe. Strange key. H. Woodcutter's axe. Croft. Was that a zombie? No, nope. was that? Uh... Trees are truly vital resources. Oh, vital resources. Can I do? Can I equip? Oh, I can only equip one thing at a time. Boo! Right, trees are vital resources. Right, cut down trees. Okay. Huh. Uh, there's something wrong with your animation, or am I just doing it wrong? Ah, yes, I'm doing it wrong. I was too close. Right, I need one more log. Why does it always tell me to cut down a certain amount of trees, but then I always have to cut down one more thing? It's like with the bushes as well. Missed. Missed. Nice. Using the method you've just learned, try crafting a pickaxe. I will try crafting a pickaxe. You try crafting a pickaxe. Right, I've got pickaxe. Uh, I suppose I equip said pickaxe. Now, let's use our crafted pickaxe to gather stones and minerals. Nice, I like that animation, it's nice. Oh. 
Oh, that, that was really loud, that was. Let me take a Snickers bar. Snickers, Snickers, shove them in your knickers. No, please don't. Right, how do I... Ooh, I'm really hoping that eating doesn't make that noise. Bushes and zomers are different things, apparently. Hey, ever wake up on a zombie island and feel like you're left alone? Uh, I'm who Jamal are you? Price, the mechanic. Uh, Jamal! So, let's kick things off with that. I don't know who you are. Kick, kick things off with what? Uh, building equipment workbench, what, just... Just out in the, you know, out in the wilderness. I got a cloth. Why did it make the sound of the Terminator coming? The day. Thank you, Joe. You're a fountain of knowledge. Uh, what is that? Manure. Yeah, boy. Let's take the manure. Um... I want to see what combat's like, so let's go down here. There's bound to be a zombie down here, right? Oh, B. Oh, it's a completely different way. Equipment bench. Build. Uh, I am going to put you... How do I rotate you? Middle mouse but ah oh, middle mouse button sweet. Um, I'm going to have to put you on the road, Jr. Oh, Although it's not let. Oh, because I was hovering off the floor. A for a oh, shut up, Joe! I'm getting sick of you already. The crafting bench is pretty handy, you know. Yeah, because you can craft. Yeah, I got that. Ooh, I can make me... Ooh. Knuckle dusters! Crafting failed. Yeah, because I ain't got no nails. Can I craft a bow? Yes. I craft a pipe as well. Nice. Uh, I'll equip the pipe. Equip the pipe. Seems like we've gathered a lot of equipment. Aww. No, we haven't gathered a lot of equipment. We've made a lot I'm of equipment. I'm more of an up close and personal kind of guy. But you? Looks like you could use some long range firepower. But, but, but why, why am I not up close and personal? Why, why am I not allowed to do that? Right. Uh, craft the bow. Oh, well, my men will use the bow. <laughs> Not enough ammo. <laughs> uh, I kind of knew that, but you know, whatever. Knife on. Let's get some twigs a moving. Five hours later. Oh, do I only make them in lots of five? Oh, okay. Right. Now we've got enough. 30, that should be enough. Equip that bow of yours and shoot an arrow towards our lovely crafting bench. Uh. Ooh, okay. Uh. Right, can I get my arrow back? Oh, is that it? No, that was grass. Oh, that's that's cool that you could get your arrows back. Um, uh, attack bow. What? Yeah, I've already made a bow. 
Oh, you wanted me to hit it. Nice. Don't just leave that crafting bench behind. That's a waste of good resources. Uh, I won't. I can make a claw hammer. Let's make a claw hammer. Once you've got that hammer equipped, there's a bunch you can do with it. Why equip the hammer? Uh. Repair. Uh, I don't want to repair. I want to uh, equip demolish. that hammer and head over to the crafting bench to start the dismantling. Uh, yeah, I have. Um. Oh, I could do it. It was just red for some reason. Okay. Listen up, soldier. Well, I'm a soldier I am now. Captain Axton Obey my commands. And learn the skills to survive on the battlefield. I want to go and investigate. Alright, oh, kill a zombie. Alt to dodge. No, that's control. Nice. Alright, kill a zombie. Well, if you give me a zomba to kill, I will kill a zomba. Mm. Fire! Something's going to happen. Something's gonna happen. Nice. Uh, go away. Stabbing attacks are effective in narrow nice. areas like inside buildings. Hang on. Oh, right, okay. Um, I did shoot the other one. Can I not get ammo back for him? Leave my Joan alone! Hey, I kicked him. Um, hello, what are you? I kicked him up the bomb, do da. What the hell are you, mate? And why, more importantly, why are you running away? Well, you're not now. See? Nice. Ah! Come on. Ooh, box. Come on, box. Don't fail me now, box. <gasps> oh, I thought I got a re revolver then. Handgun ammo. Handgun? Handgun ammo. Ooh. Leather helmet. Leather shoes. And leather gloves. And a small cloth bag. Right. Nice. I like how the uh, the avatar changes as well. I like that. Right. Right. Now. Can I look that? <gasps> nice. Get on, Joe. Joe, get on. We're going on an adventure. Go and loot that house over there. Ah, uh, that's a tree, BC. Uh, no one taught me how to drive. I do quite well, though, don't I? Something's going to happen. Hello, boys! Ow! 
Yeah, kick him while he's down. Combo! Um, I'm severely injured. How are you, Joe? Oh, that was... Uh, damn. Ah, uh, greetings. At last we meet. Who are you? Gilbert Foster. Why are there so many people alive in the apocalypse? Open the construction menu to lay down that foundation. What foundation? Um B build a foundation. Foundation build. Build a foundation. Nice. How about expanding the foundation further? Oh, come on. Okay. Another foundation. Boom. Two foundation. Oh, oh, snap. No, no, it's control. When constructing buildings, remember, you have the option to adjust the height. Okay, cool. Right. Q, okay. So we got to build another one. Q is lower. E is higher. Okay. Uh, one is... Is that a Zoma? Yes, that's a Zoma. Nice. Insufficient building materials. Right, okay. There for no reason. Oh, right. Nice. Next, let's install some stairs to reach the higher levels of your foundation. Oh, is this meant to be a serious building? Oh, I do apologize. Right, build some stairs. Oh, I didn't rotate them. Oh, there we go. With it, you can transform logs into processed materials nice. like wooden planks. What? Oh, a material workbench. Um, build, production. Uh, I haven't got the stuffs. I need a log. Right. Chopping, I must go. Hey, Iron Vein, can you I have your tree? Nice. Right, now what? Um, make how many wooden blanks? Is it four? Yep, four wooden blanks. Uh, oh, we can only make one. No. What do we need for it then? Logs. One plank per log. Okay. Is that a zombie or is that a bird? Let's go and investigate. Uh, uh oh. Joe, you will need assistance, Joe. Joe's kicking ass. Joe's kicking all the ass. Zombies sometimes expose their weaknesses. Oh. Uh, we were just getting started. Oh, you were. <laughs> you were getting more than started in there, love. What you looking at, Joe? Joe, what you looking at? What you looking at, Joe? Me doing all the hard work? Yeah. No, uh, four wooden. Oh, we've got 15 wooden planks, apparently. The crafting bench allows you to process a mm -hmm. wide array of resources. Yeah. 
equip the crafting hammer. Why? Upgrade. Upgrade. Okay. Oh, so now I can make bricks, can it? Well, <laughs> I kicked it. Sorry. Make bricks. How am I meant to make bricks? I have to upgrade it again. How do I make bricks? Craft. Oh, craft bricks. Okay. I can make four bricks. Nice. With better gear, we can overcome the situation. Joe, there is a time to talk and a time for action, but there's never a time for you to talk. Processing ores is a vital step. A uh, vital step. What? Um. Iron ingot. Okay, we're going to have to equip. Our pickaxe again, aren't we? Uh, that's a big vein. That's what the doctor said when he was about to take blood. Oh, oh, someone's having a hissy fit. Joe! What do we get? Research data. Lovely. Right. Iron ore. Craft an iron ore. And what else? what else do we need to make? Shall we take a breather for a moment? Shut up. Stop kicking. So an iron ingot. Got the iron ore. Surprise, surprise, we need more branches. Right. Wow. Let's go branch hunting. Nice. Two. Uh, I think we... What else do we have to make? Copper wire. I don't think I've got any copper. Oh, surprise, surprise, we need more twigs. Oh, copper wire. Nice. Um, upgrade. T is not working. I think I upgraded it too much and bugged it out. Demolish. Maybe if we only have one out, I can upgrade the other one. Yes, I can. Aha, I think I might have successfully unbugged it. Nice. Creating things by hand is both satisfying and enjoyable. Wouldn't you agree? Yes, I would. Right. Build a crafting bench. That's what I have. No, that. Crafting bench. Okay. Right. Put that there. Uh, build three nails. Three nails. Uh, oh, we can't build the other one. Oh, well. Two for now. What's the other thing? Rope. Oh, stop kicking it, love. Right, so we need... What do we need to make a nail? Stop kicking it! Piece of iron. Uh, another one. Right. Now what do we need? I imagine you must be quite worn out from the relentless struggle to survive. Oh yes, immense. Right, build a sleeping bag. Um, do I have to build one for Joe as well? Uh, build. Uh, put it 
there. So I have to rest. Uh, rest. Oh, nice. If the zombies attack and you lose all of your health, you won't have the strength to flee anymore. Oh, won't I? <laughs> I like the way she's just. Oh, I'm gonna tipos on the bed and rest. Feel something around us. Well, it seems you're fairly prepared now. With this level of readiness. You stand a fighting chance while searching for the mutant substance. Let's move to the research center Walter mentioned. Open the map to check your location and start moving. Open the map to check the location. Right, I'm gonna need my trusty bike. Come here, bike. Get in! Nice. Follow me to infinity and beyond. I want to know, can we run any zombies over? Um. Um. Uh, we seem to be... That was a fun ride. Yeah, it was. Oh, uh, um. What? <laughs> uh, okay. Um, that's a thing. Right, let's go. True. Be alert for bears and also be alert for zombies. Right. Joe, you may die, but it is a sacrifice I am willing to make. Right. Uh oh. Operation Joe, go! Um, I'm out of stamina. Joe, help me. I'm out of stamina. Oh, do you, do you scream them in, do you? Oh, you've got to die. Oh, no. Still some coming in. Well, oh, you're both screamers anyway. You're a dead screamer now. Whoa, drop kick! Yeah! Drop kick! Nope, stamina. Wow, Joe, you are a tremendous fighting force. Here, have a painkiller. And have a. Uh, you didn't fight with your pipe. From this. Ooh. Don't mind if I bloody well do. If I put them on. Nice. Pauldron. It's a pauldron. I don't know. Alright, uh, I think I'll give me other stuff to, um... Wait, why would we break a laptop? Oh, I think it's the note next to it we got to look at. Your mutant substance is showing particular transformative properties that we hadn't anticipated. This strange change that occurred during the molecular, at the molecular level, shattering our theories and enriching our imaginations to uncover the to uncover the unknown hidden in this mutating substance we handed it over to dr david 
As a pioneer in this field, Dr. David possesses exceptional skills in dissecting the essence of this complex material and decoding the secrets within. His experience and focused research will be a most crucial tool in interpreting the properties of this mutated substance. Oh. Yeah, what do you want? Lying. According to the experiment log, there's a storage for the mutant substance on the second floor. Oh, right. The cool. The Humanity Project was led by the extraordinary Dr. Cleon. I gained a lot of knowledge through Dr. Cleon's writings. It's hard to believe his project turned the world into this. Yes, it is. Some mutant substance around here. Yes, we're going to get the mutant substance. Right, everybody, that was my badly coded impressions for Night of the Dead. I'm really enjoying this game so far. Um, yeah, there's not a lot else to say about it. It's not bad, apart from the, um, I don't much like the enemy AI. But apart from that, you know, it, I really like it. I like tower defense and I like survival games and it's a mixture of the both as well. Um, I'm really looking forward to surviving my first night or in my case probably not surviving my first night. But I thought the video was long enough already so we kind of called it quits where we did. But I will definitely be playing more of this game and I don't know if I get my friends involved. I might be recording it. I don't know. It depends how much you guys enjoy it. Right, guys, if you did like the Badly Coded Impressions video, then please hack away at the like button and maybe even do a cheeky subscribe as well. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see all of you in the next Badly Coded Impressions video. Bye-bye for now, guys.